Keeping in the guard at the NYPD after 39 years, Chief of Department Terrence Monahan says he's retiring. But he's not done working for the city just yet. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor has more on that and his replacement. He took a knee with demonstrators last summer. Was also attacked and injured at a protest at the Brooklyn Bridge and recently came under fire for the NYPD's handling of city protests. Outgoing NYPD Chief of Department Terrence Monahan has been very visible in the past year, but today he changed out of the uniform and into a suit. I tell you, leaving the NYPD is probably one of the toughest decisions I've ever made in my entire life. This has been my life. 20 years old, I came on this job. Now turning 60 in a couple of weeks. I'm a New Yorker through and through. Born and raised in the Bronx. Some people say I may have a little bit of an accent. Monahan became the 40th chief of department for the NYPD in 2018, overseeing about 40,000 uniformed and civilian members. He joined in 1982, beginning his career at the 41st Precinct in the Bronx, and has been called the architect of the neighborhood policing philosophy, overseeing its implementation taking over as chief of department. For me, this was an easy choice. Chief of detectives Rodney Harrison, who thanked his mentor and friend, Terry Monahan. Harrison, whose birthday is today, was raised in Jamaica, Queens. I grew up around unfortunate gang violence and, and drugs. And then I came on his job saying, what can I do to save people? He began his career in 1991, working his way up the ranks. In 2019, he made history as the first African-American chief of detectives. Today, another promotion. I believe I'm the third uh, African-American to be the chief of department, and uh, I'm flattered. Uh, but I also want to make sure this is somewhat clear. I'm also qualified for the position. He directly addressed the men and women of the NYPD. That I have your back. As for Monahan, he's been named senior advisor for recovery and safety planning for the city. He says he's been thinking of retiring from the NYPD for a while and moving into the private sector before he got this offer. He starts tomorrow. In Midtown, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. Monahan is still set to meet next week with the civilian, civilian Complaint Review Board over the police response at two of the summer's protests. A CCRB spokesperson says in part they expect to interview Chief Monahan and other senior personnel regardless of whether they are still actively employed with the NYPD or not.